हेलो फ्रेंड्स आई एम प्रोफेसर राजेंद्र कोरान ने फ्रॉम माय यूट्यूब चैनल टीच इजी इन दिस एम सीरीज इन दिस पर्टिकुलर वीडियो वी विल डिस्कस द एम ऑन द टॉपिक स्लोप एंड डिफ्लेक्शन ऑफ थियरी ऑफ स्ट्रक्चर नाउ बिफोर वी स्टार्ट विद द क्वेश्चंस आई वांट टू डिस्कस यू विथ यू वन थिंग एज फार एज स्लोप एंड डिफ्लेक्शन आर कंसर्न there are two standard cases of cantilever and two standard cases of simply supported beam for each case there is a standard formula for maximum slope and maximum deflection so in all there are eight standard formulae four formulas are for cantilever and four for simply supported beam on each of this formula mcq can be asked first eight questions are on this formula only and in case formula is not to be given then the loads and spans can be given in the terms of figures so you will have to calculate this but there is no other alternative than to remember these eight standard formula so let us start with the questions question number 1 a cantilever of span l carries a vertically downward point load w at free end the maximum slope will be a wl square upon 2 ei b wl cube upon 3 ei c wl cube upon 24 ei and d wl square upon 16 ei this is the first standard formula whose answer is wl square upon 2 ei hence the correct answer is a wl square upon 2 ei question number 2 a cantilever of span l carries vertically downward point load w at the free end the maximum deflection will be a wl square upon 2 ei b wl cube upon 3 ei c wl cube upon 24 ei and d wl square upon 16 ei this is the second standard formula of maximum deflection for a cantilever carrying a point load at free end and the correct answer is b wl square upon 3 ei sorry b wl cube upon 3 ei question number 3 a cantilever of span l carries vertically downward UDL of intensity W kilo Newton per meter on entire span. The maximum slope will be cantilever carrying UDL on entire span. The maximum slope is WL cube upon 6 EI. Correct answer is C WL cube upon 6 EI. Question number four. A cantilever of span L carries vertically downward udl of intensity w kilo newton per meter on entire span the maximum deflection will be the standard formula the maximum deflection is wl raised to 4 upon 8 ei hence the correct answer is d wl raised to 4 upon 8 ei question number 5 simply supported beam of span l carries vertically downward point load w at the center the maximum slope will be first standard case of simply supported beam and the correct answer in this case is wl square upon 16 ei so the correct answer is d wl square upon 16 ei question number 6 a simply supported beam of span l carries vertically downward point load w at the center the maximum deflection will be now maximum deflection will be wl cube upon 48 ei standard formula so answer is b wl cube upon 48 ei question number 7 a simply supported beam of span l carries vertically downward udl of intensity w kilo newton per meter on entire span the maximum slope will be a wl cube upon 24 ei b wl cube upon 3 ei c wl cube upon 6 ei and d wl square upon 16 ei here this is the case of 
simply supported beam carrying a UDL, then the maximum slope will be WL cube upon 24EI. Hence, the answer is A WL cube upon 24EI. Question number 8. A simply supported beam of span L carries vertically downward UDL of intensity W kN per meter on entire span. The maximum deflection will be simply supported beam carrying UDL on entire span. The maximum deflection is 5 WL raised to 4 upon 384 EI. Hence, the correct answer is D 5 WL raised to 4 upon 384 EI. Question number 9. For a cantilever carrying vertically downward loads, the slope and deflection will be maximum at A. Fixed end B. Center of span C. Free end and D. Any other point. Now this is a conceptual question. For a cantilever carrying any downward point load, deflection will be always maximum at free end. Hence the correct answer is C. Free end. Question number 10. For a loaded cantilever, the slope and deflection is always zero at A. Fixed end B. Center of span C. Free end and D. Any other point. For a cantilever, for cantilever, fixed end slope and deflection is always zero. Hence, the correct answer is A. Fixed end. Question number 11. For a simply supported beam carrying a vertically downward point load W at the center, the deflection will be maximum at A, left hand support B, right hand support C, center D, any other point. If a simply supported beam carries a central point load, the deflection will be definitely maximum under that load that is at the center. Hence, the correct answer is C, center. Question number 12. For a simply supported beam carrying downward loads, the deflection will be maximum at A under the point load B at the point where slope is 0 C at the center and D at any other point. Now in this question, the simply supported beam carries downward loads. Wherever deflection will be maximum, if you draw the tangent to that curve, that tangent will be horizontal. That means its slope will be zero. Hence, it is always mathematically proved that the deflection is maximum at which the slope changes its signs. That is, the slope is zero. Hence, the correct answer is B at the point where slope is zero. Thank you.